It is a city where passion for football is red hot. Welcome to Naples in southern Italy. My name is Derek Ray, positioned here on the commentary gantry, and sitting next to me, ready to give you all the analysis, is Stuart Robson. And the focus is very much on Serie A, the top division here in Italy. It's Napoli up against Inter. Thanks, Derek, as always. This should be a good game. Great atmosphere inside the stadium. We've got two teams full of quality, some interesting matchups, and two coaches that want to play an attractive brand of football. What more could you ask for? Here's the team for Napoli. David Ospina begins in goal. Lorenzo Insigne starts with Matteo Politano in the wide areas. And the starting role in attack today is handed to Dries Mertens. And a look at the Inter team. Samir Handanovic begins in goal. Stefan de Frey plays with Milan Striniar in central defence. Hakan Chalhanolu starts alongside Marcelo Brozovic in the centre of midfield. And Edin Dzeko starts alongside Lautaro Martinez. And Perisic takes it forward. He has teammates he can play it to. Chalhanolu. On to Dzeko. A terrific defending to stop them progressing. Well, good luck to any defender trying to slow down this Inter attack. They've been wonderful. Well, their attacking play on the road has been second to none. It's been inventive, it's been precise, and most importantly, it's been clinical. They really do play with such confidence when they break forward, which I'm sure we'll see again today. He has time to play it over. Guisa Giovanni Di Lorenzo it's with Onguisa Amir Rahmani and now Zielinski Politano that is a very fine challenge in difficult circumstances Brozovic Ivan Perisic happy to pass the ball but remaining patient but then the commentator's curse comes into play Zielinski Mertens never needs a second invitation to go forward good looking move well nothing comes of it it looked promising Brozovic now Dzeko Barella Martinez Barella has it Chalanolu Dries Mertens Politano Mertens an authoritative challenge Dzeko Martinez Barella no possibilities inside the box he's blocked it Politano and Fabian Onguisa Fabian he's given us away Martinez and there it is the half-time whistle Inter find themselves on level terms at the break as always very keen to get your analysis yeah, we've been lauding their attack in play, but today they've just been below their normal standards. They've lacked that little bit of sharpness, but credit to their opponents, they've defended really well all over the pitch.
The teams are ready to have a go at each other again as the second half commences. Chalanolu. Perisic with the ball. Brozovic. Barella has it. Just looking for the right moment for that final pass. Well, didn't go as a plan in the end. Well, the counter chance looks very real. Given away by Napoli. Martinez. Now Brozovic. Barella. Good strength to keep the ball. Matteo Damian. Still level here, but the pressure escalating. Defensive excellence there. Zielinski. And so 30 minutes left for play in this one. Can he play it in? Teammate in support. Insigne. Well, that's how to put in a clean tackle. Not much time to make up his mind. Bodies forward and the break looks on. And return to Chalanoru. Terrific block. Zielinski. Martins. Now Insigne. Given away by Napoli. Skriniar. On the ball, Bastoni. Ivan Perisic. Ball lost by Inter. Mario Rui. Well, I think a winner's coming here, as do these Napoli fans. They're making so much noise now. Well, the two sides still locked together. And a set piece, a corner, can make all the difference. Well, they haven't created too much lately, but the fans know this is a chance to take the lead here. They decided that now is the time to go to the bench. And a short corner, let's see. And Visa. Textbook defending inside the box. Correa. Well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break. Can they push ahead in the closing stages? Chalanolu. Well, nothing comes of the attack when all is said and done. Correa. Options in the centre. Well, that's how to do it inside your own penalty area. Well, Napoli have to get the ball forward quickly now. The crowd are demanding just that little bit more effort. What a finish we've got on our hands here. And Visa. Mertens. Can he put them in front? And there's the whistle. They can't be separated after 90 minutes.